The Lithuanian military has finalized a deal to purchase MP7 submachine guns from the German manufacturer Heckler & Koch. The Procurement Division of the Lithuanian Ministry of Defense announced the contract award on the European Procurement Platform TED, dated October 2, 2023. The deal, valued at 1.56 million euros, involves the delivery of an undisclosed number of firearms. Heckler & Koch was the sole bidder in the tender process, and the contract is set to last for 72 months. Lithuania has approved the purchase of MP7S for 1.56 million euros, and the contract is expected to span 72 months. This acquisition allows us to delve deeper into the submachine gun from Heckler & Koch. The MP7 submachine gun, produced by German manufacturer Heckler & Koch, is a personal defense weapon that was introduced in 2001 and is currently used by more than 20 countries. It has seen combat in various conflicts, including the war in Afghanistan, the Iraq War, Operation Inherent Resolve, and Operation Neptune Spear, as well as the conflict in Papua. The MP7 is a versatile firearm, weighing approximately 1.90 kg with an empty 20-round magazine as a personal defense weapon, PDW, and around 2.10 kg in its MP7A1 variant. The weapon has an overall length of 638 mm with the stock extended and 415 mm with the stock collapsed. The barrel is 180 mm long, and the weapon itself has a width of 51 mm and a height of 169.5 mm. The weapon uses HK 4.6 by 30 mm cartridges and operates with a gas powered, short stroke piston and rotating bolt system. With a firing rate of 950 rounds per minute and an initial velocity of 735 meters per second when loaded with Fiocchi CPS black tip ammunition, the MP7 is an extremely effective weapon at short and medium ranges. Its effective firing range is around 200 meters. Regarding the feed system, the MP7 can accommodate detachable magazines of 20, 30, or 40 rounds. For aiming, it is equipped with tritium illuminated flip up night sights, as well as adjustable handgun and rifle sights. These features make the MP7 a weapon of choice for various armed forces and security agencies worldwide. With this acquisition, Lithuania is modernizing its close quarters combat capabilities. These capabilities were severely tested during the conflict between Ukraine and Russia. Lithuania thus appears to be learning from modern warfare.